From humanity's darkest moments came survival. From survival came light and the blooming of a new life. The Holocaust Education Film Foundation proudly presents Surviving Birkenau, the story of Dr. Susan Spatz, as told in her own words for the first time at the age of 96. Born in Vienna in 1922, Susan Spatz was an only child who lived a life of privilege until the Nazis invaded Austria and she and her mother found themselves in the trap. And I said, whatever you say, I am not leaving. You can stay with me here, but I am not leaving. And that was the last time I saw my mother. Deported to Theresienstadt and ultimately interned at the notorious Birkenau death camp, Susan survived an astonishing three years before a long and brutal death march led her instead to liberation. In Surviving Birkenau, Susan recounts her experiences with vivid memory and detailed honesty. The train drove through this large, strange gate with a tower over it. And as we drove through and stopped, what you could see was one chimney blazing flames and smoke curling out of it. It stank to high heaven. It smelled, I mean, you couldn't identify the smell, but who in the hell would identify three, 400 people under the chimney burning? Human beings being, being burned. How would we know? Only it was this sickening. With the assistance of the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum, the Holocaust Education Film Foundation brings Susan Spatz's story to the forefront for generations to witness. And I could sit or jump or walk or roll in the dirt, whatever I wanted. That was, I, well, that was freedom. That was my first taste of freedom in three years. Surviving Birkenau, the Dr. Susan Spatz story, 